Your Excellency Deputy President, uh, our good friend, uh, Ndugu Justin Muturi, Speaker of the National Assembly. The leadership of the Democratic Party who are here, Mze Munyao, Sao, and all others, the Secretary General, General Yakub, and my colleagues in Kenya Kwanza. First, I just want to express two things. The first one is to say Karibu Ndugu Kwa Kenya Kwanza Alliance. To Natoa Shukrani, we are happy that um, a party with such a history led by good people, experienced public officers in this country, have voluntarily chosen to be part and parcel of the Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance. This is a historic day. And ladies and gentlemen, when we said there would be an earthquake, surely this is another earthquake. Because if we just sit back to actually internalize the import of this session to the people of Kenya, not too long ago, the judiciary of Kenya sent a very strong message, first through the High Court, then through the Court of Appeal, and more recently through the Supreme Court of Kenya, that they stand to make sure that the independence of institutions and the right of the people of Kenya shall not be trampled upon by the executive now or even in future. That was a very, very solid statement. Today, today, Kenyans should actually internalize that the head of the legislative arm of government is also sending a very clear message to the Kenyan people. Because this is the head of the Democratic Party, but please don't forget that he's the speaker of an arm of government, recognizing the Constitution. He is also sending a very clear message to the people of Kenya that democracy cannot be undermined and should not be undermined. So we salute you, we salute you, and we salute you yet again. Finally, today is supposed to be a deadline um, for political parties to submit uh, documentation uh, to the Registrar of Political Parties. And that is if you are putting in your papers as a coalition party. Because the recent amendments to the Political Parties Act introduced the component of a coalition political party. I want to make it clear that the Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance will not be submitting anything today so that there is no conflict or confusion. We are going in as a coalition of parties and not a coalition party. That distinction is so important. Please, the media, help us. Help us to disseminate this information to the public across our boundaries that we, as Kenya Kwanzaa, are going in as a coalition of parties. And that is to underpin exactly what the speaker has said, that we anticipate and we are going to work with other parties. We in Kenya Kwanzaa want to work with other parties, but also to give those parties the opportunity to be identified, to have their identity, to have their respect as much as we work in a coalition. 
they also have to stand out and have their identity. And that is why we are going as a coalition of parties. And the deadline for lodging our document is actually on the 9th of May. So I hope that clarity will now help uh, our supporters. Uh, as uh, the speaker put it, there are some fellows who will require Eno or Andrews uh, across the political divide because what we have seen from our competitors is that they are trying to force to force an engagement that does not allow for the recognition of the individual political parties and us in Kenya we are saying there is room for that recognition. So with that I now say Ndugu, well done, you have spoken for millions of Kenyans and we are happy to hold hands and journey together on this Kenya Kwanzaa ship which is for all the individual Kenyans in our country. Thank you and God bless you all. Okay, let me request uh, my good brother Moses Masika Wetangula, the party leader of uh, Fort Kenya.